The internship program launched in 2009, and since then, around 100 students have participated. This is Shepherd's Cross Farm. Our heartbeat is to just teach about basic agriculture. It's home to about 500 animals. <coughs> it sits on several acres of land in Claremore. Its mission has deep roots. Teach about the great shepherd Jesus, how we are the sheep of the pasture. And if we don't understand about good shepherds and how they lovingly care for their flock and stand guard day and night, then we can't understand a good shepherd who would care for us. Dr. Diane Dickinson and her husband, Peter, are the co-founders. There are less than 1% of the population that are producing farmers at this time, and we want to make an impact. They maintain the farm, shepherd a flock of sheep, and steward a young flock of future farmers. So that we can have a generation that not only appreciates farming and connects agriculture to where their food comes from and where their clothing comes from, but also know how to provide for themselves and for our nation. The Shepherd Internship Program offers five different tracks and uses biblical references to farming and shepherding to equip high school and college interns with basic farming skills. They learn livestock handling. If they chose a wool track, they'd learn how to process the wool all the way from washing it to finished product, which is yarn. In the garden, they learned how to tend the garden, how to plant, how to, how to harvest, and how to give garden tours. Alyssa Patterson interned last September. Agriculturally, I've learned a lot about helping out with the animals and um, just how to run a farm. She loved her experience so much, she's back doing her residency. I don't know if I'd want to own a farm myself someday, but um, it's really given me a lot of good pers perspective on different things that I might want to pursue. If you're interested in applying, we have included a link to the application on our website, kjrh.com. In studio, Janet Quesada, Tunis, Oklahoma.